What's up, YouTube? It's Nathan Reckham, and we're back for episode two. And y'all voted for our starter in episode one, so we're gonna pick up that starter. And I'm just gonna say, I called it. I said all three of you were gonna vote, and a lot of people, a lot more people watched the episode, which is really great. Um, way more people watched it than my first video at this time when it went up. But uh, I said three people were gonna vote, and three people voted, even though. Uh, a, decent handful of people watched it but uh, the votes were unanimous and uh, everyone voted for Mewtwo just kidding Heracross and so we're gonna scoop up Heracross and uh, do you want Heracross yeah I think that's great that's a great Pokemon too gotcha all right, and we are going to nickname this Heracross. And uh, my boy Derek threw in the name Dim, uh, which is from A Bug's Life. It's the beetle in A Bug's Life, which is pretty funny. I never would have thought of that. But, uh, and I, I Googled it. It looks kind of like Heracross, so it's perfect. Uh, Dim. Mr. Pokemon lives a little bit beyond Cherry Grove. The next city over. It's almost a direct route there, so you can't miss it. But just in case, here's my phone number. Call me if you call me if anything comes up. Okay, so first thing First thing we got to do is uh If your Pokémon is hurt, you should heal it with this machine. Feel free to use it anytime. First thing we got to Reckon, I'm counting on you. You done? Okay, first thing we gotta do, we gotta change this text speed to fast because I'm sure, ooh, and we got frames in this game. Um, I'm sure you could tell uh, I stumble over the words sometimes and it's because I'm trying to keep it uh, a straight thought, um, but uh, the text isn't going fast enough. So let's do, uh, let's do, let's do, let's do this one. Um, yeah, that's pretty sweet. Okay, so. Uh, we need to have a conversation uh, and that conversation involves this little Pokemon right here um, I didn't want to say anything in the last episode because uh, You know, I'm the realist and I ain't scared, but uh, I knew I had a feeling people were gonna pick Heracross and I knew if people picked Heracross the rival would steal this Pokemon right here, so uh, unless the game doesn't work that way and it's randomized again for what your rival gets, but I'm pretty sure our rival is going to scoop up this Mewtwo. And if you didn't watch the first series and you don't know how this works, our rival, the only Pokemon they carry throughout the entire game that isn't randomized after the first time is the starter. So whatever their starter is, that's our rival's Pokemon for the whole game. So, not only is it a Mewtwo, it's also super effective against my Heracross. Um... Granted, bugs get against psychic, but uh, psychics get against fighting, and so uh, it's gonna be interesting. But uh, let's check out Heracross real quick. Check out Dim. Ooh, he's got an item. What you got? What you got? What you got? Wait. I'm not gonna take it. I'm not gonna take it, and I'm gonna tell you why in a minute. First, we're gonna look at these stats. Ooh, he's so cool. Has an Everstone. Okay, cool. So I will I will take that. Um, tackle and Leer. Okay, hopefully we learn some moves soon. Um, fairly speedy, good defenses, and that massive attack. Oh, this is going to be a good Pokemon. Um, so the reason I didn't want to take this item is the randomizer, or the Nuzlocke, sorry. The Nuzlocke starts officially. Wreckham, I want you to have this for your errand. Thanks, bro. There are only two of us, so we're always busy. Um, as soon as you get Pokeballs, the Nuzlocke starts. So that means if I took a Pokeball or any kind of a Pokeball from Heracross, um, our Nuzlocke would start. And then if Heracross faints at any point, we lose. And so I'm also, for that reason, not going to be picking up any items until after we battle our rival, rival. If I catch a Jolteon when I come back through, ooh, it's going to be powerful. Oh, Jolteon's so cool. Um, so let's uh, get a little experience. Um, but uh, 
Yeah, so I'm going to wait until I have to battle that Mewtwo because I'm probably going to lose because it's going to know confusion and it's going to take out my hair cross. But the Nuzlocke will not have started at that point and then we will have only a few opportunities to catch a Dark type to, to battle Mewtwo in Sprout Tower. Um, I love that you can see the experience bar in this game. That was like, when that happened, when this game first came out and it was like, I get to see when I get to level up and I don't have to go look and kind of guess like... We blah 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 blah. Um, yeah, so it's cool. But uh, no, I was thinking about it, and there's uh, if we can get a dark type, I like how common these Jolteons are because there's a good chance we'll get one. Uh, there's like five dark types there's Umbreon, which I love Umbreon. Umbreon's one of my favorite Pokemon. Um, if Nappy, if you're ever watching this, I'm sorry, just cover your ears up. I know you hate Umbreon, but uh, Love Umbreon. That thing is a wall, and uh, although it's not going to be great offensively in this game because it's not a good special attacker, and Dark is a special attack. Horn attack. Yes. Um, maybe we will beat that Mewtwo. You know what I'm saying? Whatever. Bring it on. Um, yeah. So uh, if we get a Dark type Pokemon, there's Umbreon, Murkrow. Not gonna. I'm pretty sure that still stays a berry or whatever maybe i don't know we're gonna leave it um can i do this now you're a rookie trainer aren't you i can tell that's okay everyone is a rookie at some point if you'd like i can teach you a few things yes please okay then follow me i don't really want to do this but it gives us some an item this is a pokemon center they heal your pokemon in no time at all You'll be relying on them a lot, so you better learn about them. Blah, blah, blah. This is a Pokemon Mart. They sell balls for catching wild Pokemon and other useful items. I'm not going to buy those for a while. Route 30 is out this way. Trainers will be battling their po rised Pokemon there. This is the sea. As you can see, some Pokemon are found only in water. Here. It's my house. Thanks for your company. Let me give you a small gift. I got the map card. Which is going to come in handy when we are... Uh, Pokegear becomes more useful as you add cards. I wish you luck on your journey. Um, so we can know if we're on a new route. But I don't know. Does it tell you in this game? Does it... Does, does, does it... Yep. Okay, so it does tell you when you enter a new route. Let's see what's out here. What's it going to be? A Cubone. Ground type would not be bad. Nice, uh... Electric immunity. Um, I keep getting sidetracked. I apologize. Uh, so there's Umbreon. Uh, Murkrow. Sneasel. Tyranitar. Houndor. And, like, the evolutions. So there's, well, just Houndoom. Um, so technically six Pokemon total um, that, could, that we could encounter in this game. That would be Dark-type. That... Um, would completely wall that Mewtwo because Mewtwo learns psychic attacking moves which won't affect us and uh, and then Swift ditto okay I would love to n not have a ditto for my encounter here nothing against ditto ditto's cool but just in a Nuzlocke not a great not a great Pokemon um, so yeah, we're going to be crossing our fingers for a dark type real soon. And luckily, we get a lot of encounters at the beginning of this game. Um, there's that first route that you step foot on. I can't remember, it's like 29 or something. Um, we could get Grumpy 2.0. If you haven't seen the first series, uh, Grumpy was, I gotta say MVP. Grumpy was our MVP in the first, uh, season of randomized nuzlocke and uh and grumpy was a kingler and uh gosh i love to use new pokemon and not like use the same pokemon every single time but it's just it's just exciting seeing a grumpy a little baby grumpy uh i'd rather take that than the ditto though for sure um uh yeah so you get that first route and then you get the route above uh not picking that up we're going to be patient, and it's going to save us. If one of those is a Pokeball, y'all are going to be like, you're smart, Rekum. You're really smart. I'm going to be like, yeah, I know. I'm Poke Master. I've done this a few times. You know what I'm talking about? Another Grumpy. I have a feeling we're going to get a Grumpy. We're going to get a little baby Grump. 
over here. Ooh. And you know what? That Mewtwo is going to be level 5, so, you know, maybe we'll get lucky. Maybe we'll just uh, get a crit, or maybe we'll live one. We won't live one. Maybe we'll live one. We won't live one. I don't know, though. Dim's special defense looked pretty good. Um, and that's another thing to think about. They split the, the special into special attack and special defense in this game. Hello, hello, you must be Reckham. Professor Elm said that you would visit. This is what I want Professor Elm to examine. An egg, what? Huh, crazy. Where'd that come from? I know a couple who run a Pokemon daycare service. They gave me that egg. I was intrigued, so I sent mail to Professor Elm. For Pokemon Evolution, Professor Elm is the authority. Even Professor Oak here agrees, re recognizes that. If my assumption is correct, Professor Elm will know it. Aha! So, you're Reckham. I'm Oak, a Pokemon researcher. I was just visiting my old friend, Mr. Pokemon. I heard you were running an errand for Professor Elm, so I waited here. Oh, what's this? A rare Pokemon. Let's see. Hmm, I see. I understand why Professor Elm gave you a Pokemon for this errand. To researchers like Professor Elm and I, Pokemon are our friends. He saw that you would treat your Pokemon with love and care. Ah, you seem to be dependable. How would you like to help me out? See, this is the latest version of Pokedex. It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Go meet many kinds of Pokemon and complete that Pokedex. But I've stayed too long. I have to get to Goldenrod for my usual radio show. Reckham, I'm counting on you. Got it. You are returning to Professor Elm. Here, your Pokemon ha should have some rest. Thanks, man. I'm depending on you. Ring, 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 ring. Phone call, phone call. <laughs> huh, hello? Reckham, it's a disaster. Ah, uh, um, it's just terrible. You should, what should, I, I, I don't know to do it. Oh, uh, no, please get back here now. You gotta take a chill pill, my dude. It's not that serious. Well, it's pretty serious. Dude just stole a Mewtwo. Oh, gosh. I'm nervous. Boom. And uh, I will be using the speed up button. Uh, and I'm probably using it uh, more frequently as the series goes on. Can we please get a baby nappy? Get a little ghastly. Oh, and ghost types. Can Ew, we only have normal attacking moves, so we cannot even affect that thing. But I will throw Pokeballs at it until it stays in a Pokeball. And maybe we'll catch something else, like a Jolteon, that'll learn Thundershock eventually, but I don't think it gets Thundershock for a while. Um, Alright. Whew. Here we go. You got a Pokemon at the lab. What a waste. A wimp like you. Don't you get what I'm saying? Well, I too have a good Pokemon. I'll show you what I mean. Is it the Mewtwo or is it randomized again? Is it the Mewtwo or is it randomized again? Is it the Mewtwo or is it randomized again? Is it the Mewtwo or is it randomized again? It's Mewtwo! <laughs> this man has a Mewtwo for the entire game, and it's level 6 because, just like in our last series, all the Pokemon are increased by 15%. All of them. Trainers. Wild Pokemon too, I think, maybe? Um, I don't know. But, uh, shoot, we're only one level higher than this thing. This is... Yep. Bye. The Nuzlocke has not started yet. Ooh, look at that. We're living. Oh, boy. Is what it is, but we're gonna come back. We're going to, uh... We're gonna deal with that thing at a later date. Uh, remember I said we want to rise from the ashes? Well, we're gonna rise. These are the ashes, and we're gonna rise out of the ashes. <laughs> that was a waste of time. My name's... I'm going to be the world's greatest Pokemon trainer. 
<laughs> no. Damn. Oh, you're back. Okay. Cool. Um, okay, so... I don't think you can buy Pokeballs right now. I think you have to get them first from the lab. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, but actually... We are gonna buy... Three of those. One of those. And now we're gonna save enough money to buy ten Pokeballs. Let's scurry on back. And I still don't want to pick up the items because if one of them is a Pokeball and then we get an encounter, we only have the one Pokeball to try to catch something. I heard a Pokemon was stolen here. I was just getting some information from Professor Elm. Apparently, it was a young man with long red hair. What? You battled a trainer like that. Did you happen to get his name? I did. And guess what? For all the support and all the love that you showed on our first series, Derek, my boy, it's gotta be you. Um, I know it's usually Chris, but uh, can't be Chris every time. So we gotta share the love. It's gonna be Derek this time, uh, and we're gonna roll with that. Southern. Okay, okay, so Derek was his name. Thanks for helping my investigation. Rackham, this is terrible. Oh yeah, well yeah, it's terrible. You just lost a Mewtwo. You don't like want to put it in a, like a like a like a cupboard with a lock on it or something. Jeez. Oh yes. What was Mr. Pokemon's big discovery? This egg. This. But is it a Pokemon egg? If it is, it is a great discovery. What? Uh, Professor Oak gave you a Pokedex? I know, peanut butter jealous, but I got that Pokedex. Rackham, th is that true? Th that's incredible. He is superb at seeing the potential of people as trainers. Wow, Rackham, you may... You may have what it takes to become a the champion. I think, yeah, I missed what it said the first time, but I guessed. I'm a good guesser. You seem to be getting on great with Pokemon too. You should take the Pokemon Gym Challenge. The closest gym would be the one in Violet City. Reckham, the road to the championship will be a long one. Before you leave, make sure that you talk to your mom. Um, I don't want to. Reckham, use these on your Pokedex quest. Please give us ten. I think it's ten. It's five or ten. I want it to be ten. It might be five. To add to your Pokedex, you have to catch Pokemon. Throw Pokeballs at wild Pokemon to get them. Ooh, I'm nervous. The only Pokemon we saw was Jolteon, so there could be something else great or some bun cheeks there. Oh, your friend's gone. Wow, that's a cute Pokemon. Where did you get it? So you're leaving on an adventure. Okay, I'll have two. <laughs> but what can I do for you? I know. I'll save money for you. On a long journey, money's important. Do you want me to save your money? Heck no. It's the only reason I'm talking to you is to tell you no. Be careful. Pokemon are your friends. You need to work as a team. No, go on. There's no way. No, 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 no. Not in a Nuzlocke. There's no way we're giving that woman our money because we're going to need that money. I've seen you a couple times. How many Pokemon have you caught? Would you like me to show you how to catch Pokemon? No. Oh, fine then. Anyway, if you want to catch Pokemon, you have to walk a lot. Thank God they gave you the option in this to, to not do that. Okay, so this is gonna be our first encounter, or we're gonna, or we're gonna try to get through and, you nope, know, we're not, there's no way we're making it to buy more balls. What is it? Oh gosh! It's gonna blow up right in my face! It's level three. Can I live a self-destruct? I hate this. There's Jolteon in here! And you only gave us five. Whatever, it's gonna blow up anyway. Maybe not, maybe it doesn't have it at this level. It might only have like tackle and defense curl, but we're just gonna try a ball first. <laughs> Thank you. 
I'm nervous. I don't think it has self-destruct. There's no way. There's no way! Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Crit shouldn't kill. All right. Let's get this. Is, how do rocks even explode? Got him. Okay, so we have a Pokemon that's four times weak to flying, and now we have another Pokemon that's four times weak to grass and water. And just weak to a ton of other stuff. It travels by rolling on mountain paths. If it gains too much speed, it stops by running into huge rocks. That is dangerous. Um, let's name this thing... <laughs> Jolteon? Um... <laughs> We're gonna name this thing. Uh, you know what? We had one of these in the last playthrough, but we never got to use it. Uh, Splody, the Graveler. Let's just see. It won't know it. It doesn't know it. There's no way. It knows Rock Throw, though. That's actually real good for us right now. And we can affect ghost types now. Alright, let's scoop up this item up here. Which is, come on. Which is usually a berry? Or is it? No, it's not a Pokeball. I think it's a berry. Fresh water. I love it. That is a great healing item early game. Please just... Stop. Stop, 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 stop. Don't even, don't even look at me. I don't even know what to say to you right now. Okay, so, in this episode, for the rest of, the rest of this episode, we are going to, um... We're gonna go get some more Pokeballs, and we are going to get some encounters, um because we can get an encounter up there through that building and we can get an encounter on the next route. Um, and we're gonna do that. Um, it's a berry. Okay, so these are not changed. Okay, cool. Uh, no, 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 no. Pokeballs. All right. So here is what I'm thinking. Um, I'm going to... Uh, 46, okay. I think lead with Splody, because he's got good defenses. Um, and he won't kill... He should be able to hit anything and not kill it. That comes out. Um, and we can always switch to Dim if we need to. And let's just see what happens. Is there an item up here? No, I don't think so. What do we get? What do we get? What do we get? What do we get? I am not mad about that. Um, This thing will body splody though. And if it knows confusion, Dim's not going to like it either. But we're going to switch. We should be able to take one. And actually, for this series, because I didn't do it last time. Oh... Um, oh, and I've got a list of things here that I need to talk about. I'm going to write down, uh, so we have Heracross, we have Graveler, and autocorrect into Traveler, because obviously, um, and, well, I'm, nope, I'm not going to put Slow King down, because we're going to jinx ourselves. Um, that way we're not encountering Pokemon and trying to catch them when we've already caught them. Uh, you're bulky. Maybe that's my sign. Well, you just use Curse, too, so you're definitely living one of those. I'm pretty excited about a Slow King. I'm really excited about a Slow King. Okay, raising its attack again. Um, we're just going to throw a ball first. I know it should live. It will live one more. A crit. I don't know. 
Ugh. Yeah, we're gonna hit it again. Um, cause I'm pretty sure, uh, I don't know when they change it or if they, I don't know. Or even if they changed it. I don't think they did. I don't know. When you get a crit, all stat increases don't matter. I am not mad about that. Uh... She just threw a freaking... Oh, that would have been so good! Oh, I already oh, I had a nickname and everything. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Don't think about it, don't dwell on it. That thing could have lived some serious confusions from a Mewtwo, but just keep... Mm. I don't... Quit, I don't... Stop, I don't want to look at you. Um... I do want experience, though. Probably should defense curl. But this is the mental state I'm in right now. Hey, if you get a crit, that defense curl won't matter. Thank you. Look at that. Splody is coming through. Ooh, Splody's really coming through. Alright, cool. We got level 5. I feel better about trying to catch a Pokemon with Splody now. Oh man, that would have been so good! Oh, let me get my list of things I need to talk about. Um. Okay, I talked about 15% higher. In this game, uh, shiny Pokemon are officially a thing. And the way Nuzlocke's work, and you can t uh, choose to not use this rule, I'm gonna implement it just because it's probably not gonna happen anyway. Um, if you encounter a shiny Pokemon, no matter when, you are allowed to catch and use it. And I am gonna implement that rule because shinies are awesome, and I never find shinies ever. Um, it's like a 1 in 4,000 something chance. Or is it 1 in 8,000 something, and then it's 4,000 something after you get the... I don't know. It's a really low chance of finding a shiny Pokemon. I've only found a few in my life that were just random. Um, so it's probably not going to happen anyway. But just want to let you know, here in episode 2, so that you know... Um, you know, I encountered that Ghastly up here, so I'm just going to go up here. Just in case. Just because. I don't think they do like different Pokemon in different patches of grass in this game, but we're doing it anyway. Because I, I would really like a Ghastly. It's a Grumpy. It is a Grumpy. Ooh. If you guys didn't know, Grumpy's a female. Uh, you have Bubble. Alright, so we're going to get this encounter, and then we're going to end this episode off here. Okay. Since you like crits so much, Dim, I'm not going to hold it against you. I'm just... I know you didn't mean to. You just got to calm down, man. Calm down. You're too powerful. Gotcha. We got Ms. Grumpy. If it is unable to find food, it will absorb nutrients by swallowing a mouthful of sand. I don't think there's any nutrients in sand. <laughs> um, and we're gonna actually, uh, I wonder if we wanna do like a variation on the nickname. Um, We're gonna, oh uh, yeah, we're gonna do, uh, Lil Grump. Lil Grump. Welcome to the squad, Lil Grump. Already that defense is so high. You're not even evolved yet. And you're fairly fast and you hit hard. Uh, you just don't hit hard with water attacks, but, uh, good to have you on the squad. Um, gosh, that would have been nice, too. But we already have a ground type. Uh, you don't have a ground type move. There's no way. Yeah, Splody is cool and all. Um, it's beefy. It can take some serious hits. I mean, this could be, like, our next Grumpy. The only problem is... 
Grumpy resisted a decent amount of things and was only weak to two things. Um, Splody is weak to everything. Splody is weak, four times weak to grass and water, weak to ground, weak to fighting, weak to steel, weak to etc. But Grumpy or uh, Splody is beefy, so we might. Uh... Oh, what's this? Lovely mail. Oh, I hate it. Oh, we'll never use that. Except I'll sell it for like twenty-five poke dollars. Um, it's a berry. Hey, bro, give me a berry. Thanks. You're so nice. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Uh, no, 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 no. Alright, get out of my face. And, uh, that's it. We're gonna heal our Pokemon, and then we're gonna end this episode here. We're past 30 minutes. That's a, that's a good chunk. We got some encounters. Gosh, I'm so... Oh, I'm so bummed about that sloking. I just, like, that is so much power and bulk. I mean, like, what are you gonna do? Uh, I don't know. So, we're gonna continue our journey in the next episode, and we are going to get a couple more encounters, hopefully a dark type, because we gotta fight that Mewtwo. <sighs> Probably not in the next episode, maybe in next episode, depends on how fast we go and how many risks I'm gonna take, because I do like to take some risks, uh, I just... <laughs> I'm nervous, uh, but it's gonna be good. Um, also, I'm going to. Oh, I got. There's other things I need to talk about real quick. Um, I started a Twitter. If you want to follow me on Twitter, um, and then I'll, I'll put out when I get uh, when new videos are coming out, things like that, and just whatever. It's a good way to talk to me. Um, and then also, um, I don't do this often. I don't uh, like to plug the channel and like do a lot of um, promoting of like subscribe, like, comment, share, blah. But uh, I do like to do it at least once at the beginning of a series, and then once at the end, uh, just as a thank you. But, um, so I'm going to say it real quick. Um, if you're enjoying this, please subscribe. If you're not enjoying it, but you just want to help a brother out, please subscribe. Um, I really am trying to, to make a, a big channel with a lot of cool stuff going on. And, um, and I want to keep good content coming out. So, uh, and any constructive criticism is welcome as well. So, uh, thank you so much for checking it out. Drop a like. Uh, please comment because I, I, I love, uh, being able to chat with you guys and, uh, and girls and, everybody else and um that's it so i will see you in the next episode i'm gonna stop talking because i'm rambling now bye